know if you're ready for closed loop marketing. Are there any identifiers in your organization or maybe even like red flags that you can see and be like, all right, this is how we're going to fix it. Absolutely. So um, here, here's the thing. If you are doing marketing and you are also doing sales, then you are ready for closed loop marketing. Um, that's, that's as simple as it, it literally everyone should be doing it. Um, because doing anything less, I wouldn't say is a waste of talent and money. It's just that you could be uh, increasing your ROI by making more informed decisions on uh, your marketing. And then also uh, increasing your conversion rate by having a sales team that's working your qual qualifying qualified leads uh, from beginning to end. Uh, red flags would be uh, your sales process. Um, having a sales team that doesn't, uh, respond well to change. Um, if you introduce a playbook and you get pushback, um, that's an issue. If you are working in an industry where it is typical that the sales team guards their Rolodex with their life. Uh, I've worked in, uh, certain verticals where, Everything was based entirely on your relationship. When I worked in radio, for example, the salespeople uh, on our radio stations would have pre-existing relationships that they've developed over the years. And when they uh, finally uh, would work on things, it would be this very like, ooh, my precious with their Rolodex. And you, you wouldn't know who they knew. And when they left, it was just this huge, uh, brain drain when it came to lead development. Uh, so one of the the cornerstones of closed loop reporting uh, and closed loop marketing is that it has to be clear visibility 100% on both sides.